Hello buddies. In this video I am about to share my first ever sketch showing wet face and water droplets. I didn't learn it from anywhere. I just used trial and error method to achieve this wet face. I generally like free hand drawing. In order to get developed as an artist, I don't want to depend upon tricks. Though beginners may learn proportions with use of grid technique, so they can try grid technique, but should not solely depend upon it. I am uploading whole outlining of sketch so that you can learn and understand the boundaries, contours of water and droplets. Though I did make some changes later while drawing, shading in order to match the features so it's tentative outline. This sketch is more depend upon shading to get a wet look. To make water streaks, we need to create illusion using graded shading. Some parts of streak are to be made darker while others lighter. To make water contours, make outline darker and area near outline lighter while again back portion a bit darker. It will create illusion of water. As water does not flow in straight line, thus making cross waves with white boundaries is a must. Here you can see this. 
here you need to use a lot paper stone and tombow mono yes to make water droplets i shaded whole cheek a bit darker then i used to be pencil to make outer boundary of water droplets then used tombow mano eraser to erase inner part of droplet and you can see it is giving look of water droplets in order to make water streak on nose i solely used dark paper stump i made boundary of streak darker by again and again exerting pressure with paper stump by using white gel pens I highlighted the edges of water same process i used to make all water streaks perfect use of dark shade and white portion in between the streak creates wet look forehead wet portion is larger in area so i left more area white and made small marking with pencil
this is the best portion of sketch which gave it completely wet look I shaded the skin darker near the contours of water outline while lightly shaded the wet portion it gave perfect look You can see I deliberately left a little white portion above cornea. It gave look of water drop hanging through eyelashes. And again to make water streak, crossing waves and highlighting with white pencil gave it flowing look. Making longer water streak was easy. I made back outline of streak darker while front outline of streak lighter but darker than the skin tone
while making lips i used 2b mechanical pencil to draw darker wrinkles of lips then shaded whole lips with hb pencil blending with paper stump is necessary to match skin tone of lips Moreover, small parts of lips had to be left white. I also used white jelly pen to highlight white area while making wet lips and outer parts of lips. Here you can see how easily a droplet can be made. Just blend a little drawn boundary of water droplet. Then erase with the Tombow Mono internal part of droplet. Follow this process again and again.
here again you can see crossing waves I made them just by using paper stump and Tombow Mono Eraser You can see I use Tombow Mono Eraser to make water droplets in hairs. I may have missed much while making this sketch but it was my first attempt to make wet look and I moved one step ahead to reach perfection so buddies to get inspired and to inspire me subscribe my channel and keep watching my sharing Thank you.